Happy birthday to you. We last caught up with Gert Boyle five years ago as employees at Columbia Sportswear threw a party for her 80th birthday. Have you softened at all? No. Will you? No. At 90, will you be softer? No, maybe fatter, but not softer. <laughs> that, in a nutshell, is Gert Boyle. Ask her a question and you'll get an answer, whether you like it or not. Hi, I'm Gert Boyle, Chairman of Columbia Sportswear, my son Tim, our president, to demonstrate our interchange system. She's known around the world thanks to her starring role in Columbia's advertising campaign, which isn't afraid to be politically incorrect. Not-so-nice letters from Florida bombarded the company in the wake of this ad, but that's how she has run the company. I know what I want, I know how I want it done, and if that's the way it has to be, good. Boyle wasn't a businesswoman 40 years ago. That's when her husband died and she was left to figure out what to do with the company. She immediately set the tone for her no-nonsense style. If I don't know it today, if I don't do well today, I better do better tomorrow. Boyle turned the small regional clothing company into an international apparel powerhouse. Along the way, she also had a well-publicized split with the city of Portland. Columbia was looking for a new location and contend they got nothing but roadblocks and hurdles from city officials. So they moved, all right, out of town to Washington County. Only one is the toughest mother of them all. Mother Gert Boyle. With 90 not far down the road, you'll find Gert these days still at the office and still living by the business rules that made her an Oregon icon. Don't get hung up on the fact that you're a woman. Don't get hung up on the fact that you're green, yellow, black, orange, or whatever. And uh, uh, take responsibility for yourself.